Hey guys, welcome back to The Nomadic Foodie. My name is Kat, and today I'm going to show you a few restaurants to go to if you want to venture outside of downtown Delray Beach. If you want more information on Delray Beach, like where to eat and where to go to the beach with free parking, you can check out this playlist here. So we're gonna head to Ocean One, and as you can see, this is a pretty nice restaurant. It's really big. So these guys started out in Las Vegas, and what I like about Ocean One is their great value. You you can get some really good meals here for five dollars yes you heard that right five dollars and i'm gonna show you what we got they have a really extensive menu for five dollars you can get things like a half pound sirloin burger you can get a buffalo chicken wrap you can get crispy calamari you can get grilled salmon chicken parmesan fish and chips beef tacos the fish and chips was really good you can see here it's a pretty large slab of fish and i actually got the chicken parm and the chicken parm was really good i would say that the linguine that it came with was a little bland so maybe skip this one but my mom has gotten the grilled salmon before and she really liked it and my husband really liked the fish and chips and i've gotten the burger here before as well so i would recommend that and if you have anybody who loves chocolate, you definitely want to save room for dessert. I loved their bittersweet chocolate lava cake. It was so good. It was so decadent. And it leans heavily on the dark chocolate flavors. Very warm and gooey, and it was delicious. I also recommend the Mexican sundae. You have a spicy cinnamon tortilla with different nuts on it, and ice cream, and sauce. And just the mixture of the different spices with the crunch at the end made this a really Really, really good dessert so definitely save room for that and once again these two desserts were five dollars so just to give you an idea of where Ocean One Bar and Grill is, it's in a really pretty shopping area. There's different clothing stores, and they also have an IMAX theater and a bowling alley. So this is a really fun place to go with your family. Next up, I'm going to take you guys just a little bit outside of downtown by just a few blocks. So if you don't want to head out that far west, you can go to this really cute little cafe. It's called Del Rey Goodies. It's a locally owned restaurant. The outside is it's unassuming and the inside has just a few tables but they have a really good menu and a really good selection of boba teas and Asian street food so we tried out their bao buns and their piggy buns and these are so cute I can't get over how squishy and cute these are so the piggy buns were filled with either red bean or custard so it's more of a sweet bun it's not the savory bun like the pork bao buns are so you can check out their menu they have dim sum they have jian bean and spring rolls and dumplings and they make it fresh to order so you can definitely check out this cute little place so next up we have bears food shack so this is a really fun beach themed counter serve restaurant. This is more of a Hawaiian American restaurant. They have a good variety of breakfast wraps and sandwiches. They have acai bowls and they also have a keto menu. And of course they have coffee and espresso and smoothies. So I'm going to show you what we got here. This is just a bagel with eggs and bacon and a side of potatoes. Really good. This is a terry sun bowl. It's got grilled teriyaki chicken. It has filet tips and it's served on a bed of fried rice and and superfood salad. So this is very filling because there was a ton of protein here. And this is the Kona Super Bowl. You have grilled filet mignon tips and Hawaiian style shrimp on it and it's drizzled with their sauce and it was so delicious so once again chill beach vibes it's got great parking because it's a little bit away from the main strip of the ave you know or downtown delray beach so there you have it you have three more restaurants you can check out they're top rated and you can get some really fun things to eat here really good value and if you're new here my name is kat i'm the nomadic foodie and if you want to see vacation ideas and where to eat in florida i post new videos every friday so subscribe and stay tuned.